Hey guys, this is I'm a Genius here, and I'm going to be showing you a quick little video on the settings for Straight Talk on the Galaxy S4 and show you some speed tests. So, I'm going to go into my settings and just show you what I'm set up with. So, I'm going to click on More Settings and the Mobile Networks. Now, this is the AT&T Galaxy S4 variant, if you were wondering. Different settings for, for the T-Mobile version. And all right, I'm gonna scroll through my settings quickly right here. If you cannot see what they are, I'm gonna put all of them in the description, and you don't have to worry about typing it wrong or reading it off right now. But as you can see, these are all my settings I have in. I'm on the straight talk version, and then I'm gonna go into speed test. I, I actually don't have the GPS enabled on this, so let me quickly turn that back on for you guys. But here we go. All right, so getting about eight on the download right now. This is about like average speeds, I would say, for most places that I go to. I'll do another speed test right after this to see if I can get anything else better. Uh, the ping was for, uh, 95 milliseconds, not bad. On the upload, we're getting eight and a half. Also, not bad at all um, for forty-five bucks a month. I don't think that's bad at all. But I'm gonna give this another try right after this because I know I can do better. I've gotten up to about twenty-two megs is the highest I've done. I don't really do speed tests that often randomly, so. But I have done that before. It does range from anywhere from like five to twenty. Oh, here we go. Here's a better example on the speed test. 15 on the download that's pretty good it's a little above average for what I get but it's straight talk so it's doing really well can't complain at all now on the upload all right solid eight those are some pretty good speeds right there Alright guys, so here's the results again on the two speed tests I just did. I cleared out the results prior to that. I wiped my phone and installed the custom ROM, so sorry if it looks a little weird. Here are the settings again, just in case you did not catch it. If not, thanks for watching and see you guys later.